Google Fiber is expanding. The company is buying WebPass, a small internet service provider. WebPass offers high-speed fiber internet to a number of cities, including Boston, Chicago, Miami, and San Francisco. WebPass says it has tens of thousands of customers. The deal is expected to close in the summer, assuming it gets approved by regulators. How much Google Fiber paid is not known. WebPass services businesses and apartment complexes. These are areas where Google Fiber wants to gain a foothold. WebPass also has a wireless component that could be very useful for future expansions. The introduction of Google Fiber caused an uproar back in 2010. Cities campaigned to be the first to get Google's crazy fast internet service. The city of Topeka, Kansas temporarily renamed itself Google. Rancho Cucamonga, California called itself Rancho Google Munga. In the end, Kansas City, Kansas was the first city to get Google Fiber. The service provides gigabit internet for $70 per month. That's an insane amount of speed for the money. Over on Comcast, you get about 150 megabits per second at about $83 per month. A gigabit is a thousand megabits. Think about that. Fiber internet is so valuable, a new study by the Fiber to the Home Council says it increases rental values by 8%. Property values also increase 2.8% if that place is served by fiber internet. So fiber is good for everybody, except if you're competing with Google Fiber. That's it for this tech news update. I'm Ayaz Akhtar, and you can stay on top of the biggest stories at cnet.com slash update.